frugal friends. We are all a bustle getting ready, kind of last minute, slap dash, to go on our Thanksgiving road trip. Oh, we weren't sure until today if we were going to go or not, so we're just getting it done. We're going to just real quick go through the finds from this weekend. If you watched the ride along, you'll know there wasn't a whole heck of a lot, but what we got, we are happy with. And especially with how hectic things are today and trying to get all this stuff ready to go, I am totally okay with it. So I grabbed the two frames. This one, it came apart as I was grabbing it. But I'll show you the other frame. And this is no big deal. I can put that back together. I have fixed I don't know how many frames. But the other one, it's still uh, in one piece. I'll show you. This big square black frame is the other one. It's an odd kind of size. It might have been one of their custom pieces that they do, but maybe it was canceled or something. I have no idea what kind of photo or poster we could put in here. Instead, what I'm thinking is this is going to end up being an art project with a whole bunch of frames being used. What else? This I found while I was out walking around. It had some other pieces, but I didn't grab them. Stay tuned to see what I do with that because I have no idea yet. Very little from the craft stores. Some more of the faux fur, which you know we love. Fantastic. Some batting, a uh, little bit of fleece. We have the little bird. This poor thing is, the poor thing's feet are torn off, but that's not a big deal because he'll end up in probably a wreath. Two frames with broken glass, but we will take the glass out. Might even use these frames with this one on that project I was just talking about. A couple of shipping bags, which is great because eBay is doing really well right now. It is definitely buying season. Check our eBay link in the video description. 95% of what we sell is stuff salvaged from the bins. Great way to get a good deal and support the mission. If you recall, I went to one of the thrift stores and real stealth like went through their dumpsters and all the piles of garbage that they had out there and found this fabulous box of cassette tapes like Michael Jackson and Garth Brooks and Perry Como and David Bowie, all kinds of great titles and several of these brand new sealed uh, cassette tapes for recording. There were a few random game discs. I Yeah, I have no interest in those. I'll probably put them in my yard sale when that time comes around. Rod Stewart. Oh, I love Rod Stewart. Waltzing Matilda. I mean, Forever Young, super awesome song, but Waltzing Matilda. That's a really, really good one. I wonder if that's on here. Ah, uh, Maggie May. Doesn't look like it. Bummer. Anyway, if you haven't heard Waltzing Matilda by Rod Stewart, I highly recommend it. Let's see. George Michael. Zig Ziglar. Not familiar with him. Billy Joel. I love Billy Joel. So, yeah. And Bing Crosby. Several other goodies. This was definitely the highlight of our picks. Like I said, we didn't get much, but I also didn't need <laughs> much. What with all the fabulous gifts that our frugal friends sent us this week... And with all we already have going on and with it being a holiday uh, and going on a road trip, yeah, this was plenty. I am absolutely happy with it and I will get it all put away when we get back. I ideally would have it put away before we go, but that's just not going to happen because we are leaving in the wee, small, dark hours of the morning. That is all I've got for you, frugal friends. Happy Thanksgiving. I hope you have a wonderful time with family, friends, loved ones, and uh, I'm thankful for you. Take care.